welcome back to spiderworking.com's video blog and this week we're going to share with you a brand new Facebook feature the subscribe button now you might not have seen this yet but what subscribing means is that you're able to subscribe to the feed of someone on Facebook whether they're a friend of yours or not and also if you enable it on your own profile people are able to subscribe to your public feed now this is only the posts that you make public, not the ones that you share with specific friend lists or friends only. Let's have a look at how it works. Firstly you'll need to follow this link just coming up here. Following that link will bring you to this screen and there's plenty of information here about subscribers, what subscribing means and if you allow subscribers what people will be able to see. Now if you're happy enough to go ahead and get subscribers click on the green allow subscribers button. Now you have some options here about what people can see when they subscribe to you. Firstly, do you want to allow these new subscribers to be able to comment on posts or just view them? So for the time being I'm going to leave this as off, but if you really want to get a lot more comments you might want to switch that on. Notifications. When do you want to get notified about these new subscribers? When it's a friend of a friend, when it's anyone or when it's no one? So. I'm interested to see how this new subscribe feature works, so I'm going to want to know every time someone subscribes to me. Click OK and you've saved your settings. Now when you go into your profile and you see there's a new subscribers button on the left hand side and if I click on that I'll be able to see who has subscribed to me. There's also the subscriptions button and this is people that I will have subscribed to. And as you can see, I haven't subscribed to anyone yet. So let's find someone. Now I'm going to go to a page that I know already takes subscribers. And the reason I know is because one of my friends has subscribed to this person. Now I don't actually know anything about them, but I just want to show you how the button works. So if you arrive on a profile that has allowed subscribing, you'll see it here next to the add friend button, you'll have subscribe. So if I click onto that, I will be subscribing to his updates. Once you've clicked that subscribe button, you can edit the settings for that particular subscription. So if I click on that, you'll see that I can choose which updates I want to see from that specific users. Now I'll only see his public updates, but which of those public updates do I want to see? So is it most updates, all updates, only important updates, and I'm yet to see how those are filtered. Life events, status updates, photos, videos, games. So for one, I always switch off games because I'm not into Facebook gaming. And if at any time I decide I want to unsubscribe from him, I can just simply click this button here. Well, as you can see, I've decided to allow subscribers to my Facebook profile. So if you want to subscribe to my feed, I'm not sure why you'd want to, Visit this profile, this is the link, and click the subscribe button. Now I'm not sure how long I'm going to allow subscribers, I'm just trialling it at the moment, and I'm not sure what I'm going to make public that you'll be able to see. But if you want to see how it works for now, do subscribe. And if you're allowing subscribers, why not leave your link below? Maybe I'll subscribe to you too. Until next week, don't forget to check out our Facebook page where I leave hints and tips for small businesses using social media link just coming in here. Until then, bye!